what's up everyone and welcome to the first stadium vlog of the Euros 2021. We are super excited for Italy against Turkey. We are now here in a small village somewhere in Italy. We've already made the trip down from Germany today and tomorrow morning at 10 we're gonna board the plane to Rome and in the evening we will have the game. We're super excited. I hope you are as well and yeah before we start please subscribe to the channel. We will do a lot during the Euros travel to a lot of cities and as we are a really small channel if you could like the video that would help us a lot in increase the reach of the video uh, reach of the video and then yeah we'll go to the hotel and tomorrow first euro since five years let's yeah. go bathroom here then we have the bets here what are you okay, watching there football for the match yeah. something about the Italian national team yes and then we have of course also a window to the street I'm gonna show you really quick the view yeah that's it that's the room it's now 4 p.m. in the afternoon couple hours until the game 3 p.m. sorry and then yeah I think we'll get something to eat and then we'll go to the football village and then we'll go to the game. There's a lot going on in the city. Yeah, so many fans, like Germans, Turk, all the jerseys, it's so, it's so cool, I miss that a lot. We made it to the fan village of the UEFA in Rome. It's right here in the Piazza del Popolo, it's called, I think. So there's like a huge television screen where they show all the Italy matches and especially yeah, the match today, of and course. All the other matches as well. Yep. I just think just the Italian matches. No, no, just Italian is at the Colosseum. Okay, so there's a second fan zone in Italy at the Colosseum in Rome. But here we're gonna go inside uh, quick and show you what they've got here. We're going to give you our predictions for the game. Um, I think it's going to be 2 2 draw. As I said in the prediction video, um, it's a 50 50 game. Yeah. I think it's going to be a 2 1 win for Italy since they have had really good matches in the past. They had the two friendly matches, they won them really solid. So I think because of the home advantage, I'm going to give them the 2 0 win tonight against a uh, 2 1. Sorry, 2 1 win against Turkey. <laughs> Yeah! 
There the stadium is and here are all the old Olympic facilities because Rome hosted the Olympics in 1960. So that's why they also built a stadium there in 1960, so it's quite old. You can hear the Turkish fans already from the outside of the stadium. They seem to be incredibly loud. We have to wait until 8 p.m. till we get into the stadium. So we're just waiting here, sitting, drinking some water before we get into the stadium and join the action. We made it. So now the exciting moment to go into the stadium, see how it looks, see if we can see something from the opening ceremony already, and just see the atmosphere, be back in the stadium after one and a half years. So it's always, so, yeah, always the best moment to get into the stadium and get the first peek off the field. Let's fucking go. Holy shit.
close match right now. Both teams really trying to get into the game. I think Italy has a slight better start right now. Oli getting in there. Uh, next chance. Close, close, close. Oh, Demiral. Uh, battery just went empty. Missed the big chance from Insigne. So Italy is really right now the better team. But still 0-0, zero, zero, everything possible. Just taking the corner against, I think, Berardi. Oh, he's the one on the left, Lorenzi? I'm not sure. Uh, I think so, he's right back to Is Lorenzi even on the pitch? Come on. Yeah! Oh! Two really good chances now from Italy. Two corner kicks, both almost a goal. So Italy is getting close to the first goal. Better team right now, let's see, let's see. Still 70 minutes to go. Oh, Big shot. Ah. Oh, Yilmaz is on his way. Nobody in the middle. Nobody in the middle. Yeah, Mats. Oh. First chance, first chance. Yeah, first chance for Turkey. But always still a pretty small chance. Turkey fans absolutely loving it here in Rome. sitting all the way over here so we can't show too much of them we're sitting right next to the Turkish fans but there's definitely also really good atmosphere going on over there but now we have an injury on the play hopefully nothing too serious I can't see who it is but someone from Italy chance for Italy
Next chance, Italy. Oh. Italy is creating lots and lots of chances. I think the next goal is just around the corner. enjoying it, being out to zero. They are really having a really great time here. There's the Turkish bench, obviously not looking too happy, but they still have two games left to play against Wales and Switzerland, so yeah, they have to keep their head up. They still have a good chance to reach the knockout stage. Italy fans after the game. Yeah, that's it with the opening game of the Euros 2020. Really great experience. Crazy opening ceremony you saw it on TV. And the match was also really good. 3 0 for Italy. Not too good for the Turkish fans, but we still have to say credits to both uh, fans from both nations. The Turkish and Italian fans made such a good atmosphere in the city and also in the stadium that we almost forgot that the stadium is halfway empty. But now we have to make it back to the hotel because there's a curfew in Rome. But hopefully when we get back to Rome for the quarterfinal in a couple of weeks, we will have no curfew. There's not going to be a curfew, but that's a problem from the next week. And now we're focusing on the next week where we have the next match. One of the group of death matches in Hungary, Budapest. So we're going to fly there and then bring the next match for you. And yeah, we hope you liked the video. So if you did enjoy it, give us a thumbs up subscribe or write us a comment what you liked about the video and what we can do better because that's the first video that we're doing in the stadium so yeah everything it's appreciated thank you so much